Good evening, I'm Dana Tyler. And I'm Dick Brennan. We begin with breaking news. Everyone escaped unhurt after a school bus fire in Queens. New video shows just the intensity of these flames, which, which grew quickly, and then there was all that smoke out there. CBS 2's Allie Bauman spoke to the bus driver, and she joins us live in Rigo Park. Allie. Well, Dana and Dick, thankfully nobody was injured in this, but it could have been so much worse if it wasn't for the heroism of the bus driver who was behind the wheel of what's now this charred out school bus. This all happened around 3.45 p.m. on Saunders Street by 65th Boulevard in Rigo Park. The driver says he had six kids on board between 5 and 11 years old. He was taking them home from school when all of a sudden the front engine on the bus started smoking. The flame spread quickly, but the driver stayed calm and got all the kids off board where they waited until their parents picked them up. Meantime, the fire spread to five other vehicles, completely ruining a total of three of them. We spoke to the fire chief and bus driver. Take a listen. There was heavy fire. Actually, the, the, the flames were as high as the fourth floor window. It was almost like a fire tornado. But I just wanted to say that the bus driver did an excellent job getting the kids. There were six kids still on the bus, and he got them off quickly before the fire really took off. Put them out. The front and I opened the back door. The front came out. Don't be scared. Everything gonna be all right, you know. And then uh, I called uh, their parents, the school, the company. And they, they was panicking. The kids. You know. Again, no reported injuries, and you can see that crews are still here now that the flames are out, investigating before uh, investigating how this all happened before they take the bus and the vehicles away. For now, we're live in Rigo Park, Queens. Ali Bauman, CBS 2 News.